Hey guys, it's Robin, your independent Sensi consultant. Welcome back and welcome if you're new. Today I have got a new little video series I'm starting. So historically I've tried to do monthly melting baskets each month because what I usually do is I get all of my wax that I want to warm for a month and put it in a basket in my home and I pull from that through the month and I'll still continue to do that. But what I find is that most of the bars that I put in that basket aren't currently available. So people watch it and they want to use that bar but they can't get it. So what I've decided to do is I'll still do my own melting baskets the way I do. I'm not going to film them. You will still see what I melt throughout the month, whether it's available or not, in my What I've Been Warming videos. But going forward, I thought I would, it would be fun to highlight bars that you can actually get right now, that are available right now, that would be really, really suitable for the, the upcoming month. So these are 10 bars that I kind of came up with that are in the catalog right now that would be really, really well suited to the month of April in most climates. So this is again going to be based on an average climate. Where I live it's a bit colder than average, where the southern US may be a bit warmer than average. So I mean it's going to depend on your climate, but on average I think these are really really solid picks for the month of April. So in this video I have 10 bars that are currently in the spring summer catalog, and I have one bonus bar that is currently an LTO that's going to be available throughout the month of April that I think is just really really well worth picking up and well worth melting in the month of April. So the first bar I picked as an April pick is the catalog bar Starburst Sky. This was a Valentine's collection bar last year and now this year it's in the catalog. So this one is a really really pale pink and this is a soft kind of perfumey sweet type scent. It's a little bit girly. It has some musk. It's got a lot of sweetness to it. I would say a lot of vanilla tones probably. It's just perfumey and sweet. It's kind of cuddly cozy, but still very kind of light and airy. So I think this is a nice spring bar because it is kind of cuddly cozy feeling. It is kind of perfumey sweet and I think that's nice for this time of spring. Where this bar might be a bit heavy for the summer, I think for this particular time of year it's really really pretty. So Starburst Sky is my first pick for April. Next up we have one that is a catalog bar pretty much year round. And it's one I think a lot of us neglect, but I think this is a great April bar because I think in April a lot of us are doing our spring cleaning, we're opening the windows up, we're kind of airing things out, we're doing all that good stuff, and this is a great bar for that. This is Clean Breeze, which is one of our general catalog lines that's been around for a long time. This is just kind of a clean laundry scent. The thing I like about this particular one is it doesn't have a lot of floral tones, it's not too heavy, it's almost got like a lime dried sweetness to it. It's just a very classic clean scent. I think most people would enjoy this. It's just a nice clean fresh scent. That is Clean Breeze. Really like that one. Perfect for April. Next up we have another fresh scent that I think is just perfect for March and April. This is Amazon Rain. Again a year-round catalog bar. This one you can't you can't miss this one. Oh my gosh. There's nothing else like this one. This is a scent onto its own. There's nothing like it anywhere else that I've smelled. This one has some pineapple nectar, it's got some coconut milk, it's got all kinds of green fresh fruity notes. It's smooth, it's well-rounded, there's nothing sharp here, but it's fresh and clean while also being sweet and creamy. It is wonderful. If you haven't tried Amazon Rain, you've gotta, and March and April is a great time to do it. So Amazon Rain, definitely a good pick there. There's also a couple on my list here that I don't have bars of. And the first one I thought I had a bar of, but I didn't. I used mine up. It is aloe water and cucumber. Again, a year-round Scentsy bar, but this one is just perfect for that springtime. I would say March, April, May. This one's perfect for that time of year. It has aloe water, cucumber. I think that one might actually have pineapple nectar. I'll put the notes below on this. But it is kind of a sweet, fresh scent. It's maybe a little more perfumey toned than Amazon Rain and not as creamy as Amazon Rain but both scents are beautiful clean scents for spring. The next one is Lemon Drizzle Cake. I don't have a bar of this either. This is in the catalog. It is a lemon pound cake type scent with like a glaze and a little bit of lilac. And that lilac note smells a little odd on cold, but on day two of that bar, the lilac comes out more. It's like a lilac sugar note and it is very pretty. If you really, really are opposed to lilac or floral scents, you may not like Lemon Drizzle Cake. It isn't a pure bakery. It does have that floral component to it, but I think that one just screams early spring. For me, that scent is perfect April, March, even May. 
but that one is definitely spring in a bar. So lemon drizzle cake gets an April vote as well. The next bar I have here is Welcome Home. This one is just cozy light spices, very light spices. I would say like a soft cinnamon, a little bit of sweetness, but not too much. There's a bit of sweetness here without being bakery. This is not a bakery scent. This is not a foodie scent. This is a cozy kind of soft, gentle spice scent. And it's very, very homey and nice. This is nice for April because it's again, not one of those heavy gourmand bakery scents. It's just kind of soft and warm and inviting. And sometimes, especially on like a rainy April day, you might want just something a little bit cozy and comforting um, without being super, super heavy spice. This is a nice, gentle, light springtime, warm weather spice, and I really like this one. So Welcome Home is a good pick for that. Next up, we have French Lavender. This one is just French Lavender. This is a nice herbal lavender scent. There's nothing soapy here. It's just kind of a slightly astringent, but not too much, herbal lavender. It's very nice, very spring, perfect for April. I really like to mix this with vanilla. I like this with vanilla bean buttercream. And I haven't tried this yet, but I'm going to. The new Very Vanilla with this, I think would mix very well. So I would do two cubes of Very Vanilla to one cube of this. And I think that'd be a fantastic lavender vanilla mix for you. So French lavender on its own or as a mixer, great April scent. Definitely a smaller space scent though. This is on the lighter side. I would say bedrooms only. Another great April scent that I don't have a bar of on hand is Daydream Oasis. This one has like a bit of like pear and I think water lily possibly or water lotus, one of the two. It is a watery, aquatic, kind of perfumey, fresh scent. And again, just kind of, again, one of those great bedroom scents for days when the windows are open and you're kind of airing things out and it feels cool and breezy and light. And Daydream Oasis is a beautiful bathroom bedroom type scent as well. I don't know that it would hold an open layout and the scent itself does lend itself to bedrooms and bathrooms. Finally here, we have Strawberry Lemon Cake. This had been a scent of the month last spring and they brought it to the catalog this year and I'm really glad they did. This one is like a cake with strawberry buttercream and just a hint of lemon, like hardly any lemon. This is mostly a strawberry cake scent and it's really, really nice. This is spring bakery. This is light, it's a little bit sweet, it's fruity. This one has like a nice sweet tart strawberry scent to it. Lots of vanilla, lots of like cakey goodness. It's pleasant, this is just a happy one. Um, I can't see anyone disliking this one unless they really didn't like bakery. Um, this one is again, maybe a medium performer at best, but it's so, so pleasant. I would say medium strength in my open layout, about an eight hour bar, so shorter than average duration. So be aware of that. But if you're a bakery fan, you can't beat this for a spring bakery scent. Perfect for March and April. Really like this one. I will be warming this one this weekend for Easter as well. And then on to honorable mentions, which are going to be bars that are limited time offers. So they're bars that are not going to be around for the entire season, but they're available for April. And I think they would make great April warms. The first ones are the Mother's Day collection. I think all three of those bars, but especially Courage and Kindness are going to be fantastic April bars. Those are just kind of, Kindness is a kind of clean, floral, fresh laundry scent. I would say floral fresh. It is nice. It's perfect again for April. When I think of April bars, I just think of like spring cleaning and freshening things up and kind of opening the house back up to the, the fresh air and things like that. And kindness is perfect for that. The other one is Courage. That one has a raspberry note to it and it is just pretty and sweet and a little bit perfumey. Beautiful bedroom scent, again, perfect for April. And I would say May, June as well would be good for Courage. The other limited time offer bar I think is perfect for April is Lemon Lime Fizz. This is from our current Easter collection. This one has like lemon, lime, and I think sparkling sugar. Yes, this one is really, really nice. This has like a creamy, sweet lemon scent to it with just a hint of lime. It is mostly lemon though, I would say. You get a bit of a lemon cream, sweet scent, not as strong or as sharp as Squeeze the Day. And this one is actually gonna be featured in a upcoming lemon wax war <laughs> that I will have coming up in the next week or so. Um, Yes, this has been a favorite of mine this season. And this one did go in my club. This is a very, very beautiful lemon scent. It is on, it is one of our lighter lemon scents, but pretty sweet, well-rounded, smooth. Really like that one. So that is a few ideas on bars that would be fantastic to warm in the month of April and even in the next couple months beyond that as well. So I hope that gave you some ideas on what you might want to warm in the coming month. Let me know below if there's any other bars that you think would be fantastic to warm in April or ones that you just can't go through April without warming. 
I would love to hear below in the comments. One that is not currently available anymore and didn't make my list but will be going into my melting basket is one from the Moment by Moment collection a couple summers ago and that bar is called Down the Aisle and it has some green notes and it has peony and it's kind of a soft sweet floral fresh type bar. It's really pretty, really pretty, a, a spring floral bar. Um, that one and peony petal. I really like the peony type scents in springtime, so March, April, May. So I will be warming some of my down the aisle and probably a peony petal bar as well. Um, so those are other ones that are not available anymore, but I will be warming in the month. So watch for those and what I've been warming coming up. But as far as available bars, again, we'll kind of recap. We have French Lavender, great bedroom bar. We have Strawberry Lemon Cake, really, really nice bakery, a little shorter lasting, but very, very nice and respectable. Clean Breeze, great performer, very open layout worthy, nice and long lasting, pretty strong. This one is fantastic. Recommend, nice and clean. Welcome Home, nice gentle spice on the lighter side, very company appropriate if you're having people over. Amazon Rain, if you haven't tried it, you have to. This one is so, so good. Oh, yeah. I need to warm this one soon. This one is a winner. It could do an open layout. It's also very nice in a bedroom. I'd say about a medium strength. Starburst Sky. This one is lighter when you first get it. It does cure well with some time, but this is a pretty bedroom bar as well. It's kind of a perfumey, sweet, musky scent, a little bit cuddly cozy. And then the ones I don't have bars of on hand were Daydream Oasis, kind of a fresh bedroom type scent. Lemon Drizzle Cake, a floral bakery and aloe water and cucumber, a Scentsy classic, bestseller, very well loved, nice fresh scent. So those are my recommendations for the month of April. Again, I would love to hear your favorite April bars in the comments below, and I wanted to wish you all a happy Easter and hope you're celebrating with your family or enjoying some much needed downtime and relaxation. Um, other than that, I will talk to you guys in the next video. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.